Hi you guys, thanks for tuning in. This is Nia Lynn. Welcome to my dressing room. I have some beauty tips for you today about alternatives to Botox. As you can see, I'm wearing one of them. It's called a frowny. So these are wah, 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 Hollywood's beauty secret for over a hundred years, darlings. Yes, and they actually do work. Do they do what Botox does? Absolutely not. I am not a certified esthetician or beauty professional in any way. I have done makeup as my day job. Sorry about the sirens. I live in New York City at Bloomingdale's, Bergdorf Goodman, Macy's for lines such as Bobby Brown, Estee Lauder, and MAC. So I have a little beauty knowledge and I'm a working actress, so I'm on camera a lot. So, you know, we learn our tricks. Even ladies who are not on camera a lot as actresses learn our tricks. This is one of the tricks that I definitely use and it does work to soften the furrow in your brow and other wrinkles on your face. So you put it right here. I have this wrinkle, right? I don't have Botox. This is my normal face. See, it moves. Now I'm not totally against Botox. I'm not saying I'll never get it. It's just, you know, why not try other things and then like if you have to get those as a last resort. So this is what I do for that wrinkle that works. Now, usually I put a moisturizer underneath. So there's another alternative that I looked at and tried that doesn't work. And I want to tell you about it because I don't want you to waste any money. Now, I do love a lot of other products in this line that I'm going to show you. And I'm going to show you what I love, what I like, and what I hate. All right? So this is the Derm Exclusive package here. Right? Derm Exclusive. And I actually, for the most part, like all the products except for the one that is supposed to be like Botox. So... These I loved. You can see I used the whole packet. They come in this packet. They are the Micro Peel Resurfacing Pads. Now, if you're not 25, and I'm not, I'm older than 25, you're going to need to exfoliate your face, right? Because the aging process slows down around 25, and all of a sudden, it's like your skin is not renewing itself like this. So you need to start exfoliating. Now you should exfoliate properly for your face. My face isn't sensitive, so I can use like anything to exfoliate my face. But I did love these and they come in that, but you put them in this little case and then um, you can just open this up. And as you can see, there's one pad left. I saved it to show you guys and use that on your clean face after you've washed it. And it really, it was nice. It really took, you know, like that little extra bit of exfoliation, polishing, and refining. It did that. Now, the other thing that I did like from this line was this Derm Exclusive Intensive Repair Serum. Loved this. Loved this. AM, PM, loved it. Put it under my eyes. Um, I put it under the frowny. So just put a little dot like this on your finger, right? Lift up your frowny. Put it right there. And then put the frowny back on. And it helps to moisturize that area. I put it under my eyes. I put it on the back of my hands. I love this serum. I also, I'm sort of a serum junkie. I'm, I'm a big fan of serums. So that was a yes. This is also a yes. Um, loved the serum. Liked this, right? And I like it because it says for face and eyes AM, PM, collagen left. So here it is. Here's the product, right? So I just put a little AM, PM. And the thing is, is it can go near your eyes and on your face and everywhere. So I'm just going to put it down here. Always do your degletage, darlings. The reason why I don't have lines on my neck is because I've been using sunblock down here my whole life. And then I always put the extra on the back of the hands. I'm just going to show you what it's like on the back of the hands. I don't have any nail polish on. You know, these are just bare hands um, because I like to clean, clean my hands and polish them after all this and take all the, you know, stuff off them. And I do my nails at home by myself. Every once in a while I'll go to the salon with a girlfriend just to hang out, you know, and like get my nails done as like a, like a time to spend like girly time with my friends. But I usually do my fingernails at home and then I get my feet done at the salon um, because then I can change my nail polish as much as I want. This is the product that I didn't like. This is the product that they say is going to be like Botox, but it's not. Nothing is like Botox. You're not going to get the same result from anything else. Um, but if you're looking for something that is an alternative and you don't want to put toxins in your body, I would say go with the frownies. This, no ladies, doesn't work. Hated it. Okay, so what they say that you're supposed to do with this, I'm just going to pat this down um, so I can get the product off. So you see how soft that is now? It's nice and soft. Now my wrinkle's still there, right, because I don't have Botox. All right. So they say to take this. And you crank it up. My 
hands are all slippery now. You crank it up, and you, as you can see, I've used it. It's got makeup on it and everything. And the product comes in there, right there. You see that goop? And it's like, I'll squeeze it so you can see. It comes out. So you're supposed to put this like in your wrinkle, right? But look at that. It comes out like in a big glob, and it looks like a booger. So okay, so push it around the brush that they've given you. Try to blend it in. Uh, it's okay. I am not in love with this. D can you get it to blend eventually? Yes. But do you see the goop that comes out? It doesn't, and it, is it doing anything? Is it really freezing my furrow? No. I can still move my forehead. Is it a little less? Maybe. Maybe it's a little less. All right, I'll give them that. But it's just not, no. Look at it. Look at it. It looks like bookies. It's like goop. Like goopy goop. So, do I feel it freezing my forehead? How long am I supposed to wait for it to freeze my forehead? Hmm. One touch instant wrinkle smoother. Lies! Do you see this wrinkle smoothed? No. Put on these. These, are, these wrinkles are a little less. I, I just have this one main wrinkle on my face. Is it smoother? I think not, people. I think not. So this is a no. Everything else in that kit from Derm Exclusive is a yes. Definite. Definite. I will probably get this again and again and again for the rest of forever, maybe, um, along with all other serums that I like to try. So could you put it on there and then maybe put the frowny back on and, like, push it in? And, and will it do something? Yes. Um, but it's not worth the investment. Now, the, um, frownies I do like, and I would get those, right? Um, and you can get them at Ricky's and other places. The other thing is, is if you don't have frownies, you can go grab some tape. Yes, I said it, tape. This is what our grandmas used to do, guys, before all this stuff, you know, or, or our great grandmas, because these have been out for a hundred years. So those are some of your Botox alternatives. The other thing is, is just laugh more in your life and be less angry if you don't want an angry 11. Hello, <laughs> because if you're smiling, you're not gonna have a wrinkle there. So if you're happy, you're gonna have less angry looks on your face, right? This does not look good. This looks good. So find your joy internally and express that. And if you wanna go get Botox, girl, go get some Botox, right? Because it's your face and you need to do for yourself what makes you feel confident and beautiful for yourself inside and outside. So thanks for tuning in. This is Niall Lynn. Here, I should probably take this off, right? Because I look ridiculous. Have a beautiful day.